a giant... I mean, the term Fuster Cluck really kind of comes to mind. But I don't want to say that too often. In hindsight, though, hatching everything in here was probably not the, uh... Not my smartest idea ever. Or at least leaving them in there. Oh yeah, or at least leaving them in here. Uh, but I mean, at least everything's alive. So... Uh, I, I could have... I, I could have done better with that. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Welcome to the stream. Hope you're all having a great Wednesday. I know... I know we are. It's, uh... It's, it's been a good day. Been a crazy day, but a good day. So, but we're just back to play a little more Ark and uh, see what we can do. And hopefully today, uh, well, I've got some plans. What I need to do before I do anything else, though, is we need to get some meat badly. So uh, we're gonna do that, and then, well, actually, before I do anything else, I gotta clear out my the inside of my base because. Uh, like I said, bit of a mess. It's like the outset of my base came to the inside of my base. Although that having been said, we are on track now to uh, to have enough stuff to at least try for the gamma level of the boss. We're on track. I don't think we're quite there, but we're getting close. Interesting. Yeah, well, I mean, for the alpha level, I'm probably going to want to do a few more generations of reading, see if I can get some mutations and such. Um, but, by and large, I think we are at least on... We're on the right path to be able to do it. I don't know if we're quite there, but we're close. We, we also need to make a lot more saddles, though. So yeah, do we have a good Edward saddle? Oh yeah, no, okay. we, we we've got several. Okay, never mind. Yeah, uh, uh, like I've got one of them is uh, so good I can't even fit all the materials in a freshly placed smithy. Useless. Yeah, I know. I I I t uh, toyed with the idea of putting on like an item stack mod just so I could use it, but I decided against it for now. But, yeah, uh, yeah, so we are on our way. We're not, we're just not quite there just yet. But, I mean, with high-level tech rexes being, uh, being born now and being able to breed those, um, we, we're in good shape. Of course, we'll need people to. Uh, we'll need everyone who's going to be in that fight to have something that they're imprinted to. But yeah, and then Aaron should probably bring his uh, precious coveted pump action shotgun. Same way, if you had it, uh, maybe. I don't know. I I'm more. To me, I don't like spending time during a fight. Trying to shoot. If I'm on a dinosaur, I'm going to use the dinosaur. And so... Yeah. To me, it just... Not to mention, it, there's only so many that you can actually, like, wield a weapon on. And we're not really... I'm not really planning on taking any of those to this fight. So... I mean, I'm, I'm planning on taking a Ute, to be honest can make it scream yeah and you know someone should probably uh i mean we can always put the we can always have it just do it on its own but i mean it probably wouldn't hurt if we also had someone uh on a pig so but that's that's a that's those are all issues for a different day we didn't have a date on yet no but it's not like it would be hard to get one like at all Jinx it. it can be so hard. I mean, I can pick it up with an ARG, for crying out loud. It's not going to be that difficult. So jinxed. Probably, but it's not going to be that difficult. Uh, 
Okay, I will deal with sorting all of this out later. But it is, oh gosh, it's a, it's a mess. Cryopods are wonderful, I'll say that much. Ah. But. I, like I said, I have plans for today. Awesome plans. That uh, hopefully, hopefully, will involve a chibi wyvern. But we'll see. It is such a mess in front of my base. I need to... Ugh, I need to move. I don't have space for all this. It's a uh, comment telling me to go call the turtle. I can do that, you know. <laughs> hey, Desolate Spore. I don't think we've ever seen you before. Uh, welcome to uh, welcome to the stream. <laughs> Heck. Dude, why you gotta be hating like that? <laughs> All right, so what have we got here? You freaked me out for a second because I actually thought that was one of mine that you'd actually done it. You have baby Edwards right now. Uh, I I have Edward eggs, and I just put all my Edwards out front, and so. All right. Uh, let's see. Well, oh, no, not not flamingo. Flamingo two. Let's uh. Okay, Flamingo 2 and Pickles. Let's get you a gig egg of your own, now that we can breed gigs. No. Yeah. <laughs> but I love my dinos. I mean, not not the rears, but I love my dinos. Uh, Alright, what... What do we have here in terms of food? Do we have enough? Uh, maybe? Probably not. Maybe. It's a big maybe right now. If you hatch in a gig, then you're going to need like as much meat as you want to need berries for Bronco. Probably, unfortunately. Also, let me know when you I want to be there. Okay, fair enough. I can, I can do that. Five and a half minutes. Okay, uh, let's see. Where's... There's Angus, Molly... There's Chomper, okay. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Let's get through. Yeah, we'll... I might just move... At some point, actually, Eck. It's, uh... I've got too much going on here. <laughs> and what? Just abandon the dinos you have here? No. They'll come with. We'll have all the same dinos in a different spot. Yeah, but it'll be a bigger spot. Which I will then eventually complain about being too small as well. Technically... There's no wall on the land. You could just keep expanding inward. No one would stop you. I mean, I could. It's just also the feeding trough thing, but I, you, you have a point, and I may need to do that. Uh, the wall should be finished this weekend. I, I keep meaning to get on and get some stuff done in terms of resource harvesting, and then... Oh, crap, actually. <laughs> that reminds me, I need to log out from work. I was in a meeting right before I got on stream, and I uh, I completely forgot to clock out. <laughs> Alright, so let's go find some meaty McMeat meat. Uh, I don't care that you're super Easter-colored Parasaur. You are going bye-bye. Made of meat. It is made of meat, and that is the important thing. We will get that wall finished, though. Um, 
It's it's just been it's been you know I thought once the winter games were over, work would die down, but uh, it hasn't at all. And so yeah, it's it's just been very very busy. But we do have some very exciting things about to happen there. So anyway, babe, what is your plan for today? Oh, I got some breeding going on. Um. I'm going to build an otter temple now that I have otters. Do you have a male in that group? I think they're all female. Oh, uh, okay. I don't care if you're a uh, bunny over after. You're still getting eated. We need meat. You must feed... Gosh dang it, woman. <laughs> you always scare me with that. It's a job at this point. Wow, Chomper's doing 559 damage with each bite. That's a pretty respectable number. Yeah, seriously. I mean, we get uh, we get more Rexes like this, and uh, a few more Edwards, and we're we're good for the boss. A fact about which I am excited. Because we've never actually taken on a boss in Ark before, because you guys all casual out before it's ready. Or before we've taken ready. them on, just always god mode our way through. <laughs> we've... I mean, I guess technically that's true, but still. We, we've never actually done the fight, realistically. So... The closest I got you guys was on Extinction, when... Uh, you know, we were, we were working towards it, and we had mechs and stuff, and then you guys all, once again, casualed out, and it was just me taking care of everyone's base. Because, as previously mentioned, y'all tend to casual out. We do. And it makes me more than just a little bit bitter by the end. <laughs> Which is probably why I took 18 months off of this game. Out with us. I could, but I'm already casualing out enough. You see, if you, if you weren't holding me back and being like, you can't play unless I'm playing with you, uh, we would have had gigs a long time ago. <laughs> so, we still got them pretty quick. Eh, Rel relatively. Speaking. Still, though. Speaking of, has a new good one spawned in on the map? Now that you I have not there? looked yet. Um, I will go do so in just a sec. I wanted to go, like I said, I need to get meat, so. Hey, Sadie! How you doing? Happy to see ya! Alright, head over, hon. Wow, that's a lot of eggs. And not one of them, not one, is gonna be a wyvern. I'm calling it right now. I'm coming. In a second. I'm gonna call it right now. Not one of these eggs is gonna be a wyvern chibi. Oh, uh, we're doing good. We're doing good. Actually, I don't think you've uh, you've seen it yet, but uh, the the uh, mosasaur that we named after you is all grotted up at this point. So give me a minute, and I will uh, go introduce you. Okay, uh, man, the space is a mess. Right now, I'm just coming over. Okay. Uh, and I have, oh my gosh, I've got 48 eggs to hatch. All right, let's, uh, 
Yeah, well, and it's probably just going to be a bunch of disappointment, so. Is you hatching first? What was that? Which ones are you hatching first? Uh, I'm just putting these down on the ground, because they'll just be a path that I run through and hatch as I get to the uh, hatchery. Well, you mean Easter eggs. I thought you meant, like, dinosaur eggs. No. Did you get a wyvern? Uh, I just got a sarco. Maya, Mesopithecus. I still can't believe Aaron got a Titanosaur. Uh, Mantis, that's a new one. Manta? Allosaur. Iguanodon. Nothing good. <laughs> it's okay, Sadie. I'm glad that you're, uh, I'm glad that you're back safe and all. We, um... You can always catch the streams here on Twitch uh, for a little bit, or you can always check out our YouTube channel where we've been uploading them. Um, and we've, we've just got them set. I think right now it's about two weeks back, and we're just uploading them one day at a time. So there, there are always ways to catch us. Uh, but something he did miss from last time is we got ourselves a pretty new shiny little gig here and when i say little i mean obviously not little um you can't really see the colors because it's nighttime but he is very easter colored and he's pretty <laughs> he is a beautiful beautiful gig anywho though let's uh let's get inside here, by the way. Okay, cool. I am trying to navigate my way through this maze. <laughs> uh, heck, you're funny. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad you two are here. Alright, uh... Let's see what we do here. Okay, um... Where's that egg? There's that egg. Alright. Oh, wow, it's got three minutes left. Okay, you had plenty of time, Frick. I forgot that their 1% was so long. Oh, are you are you breeding with my Jerboa? Yeah, I want them mutations. <laughs> I forgot you said you were going to do that. I should probably put some lights on here. Glow sticks hanging around somewhere? No, I tend to hate glow sticks. Chuck them when you get them? Basically. But you can't grind them, so yeah, basically, that's that's what you'd have to do. Oh, what you did miss, Sadie, is uh, we've we've started, uh, we got otters on one of the streams. So, and we have started to breed them, and we're probably going to go looking for some more Easter-colored otters tonight, but... Yeah, no, that's that's a good summation of what she missed, heck. <laughs> Um, but let's see, where is, let's see, there's cuddles, kisses, ah, here we go. This one's for you, Sadie. You're, uh, the, the baby Moza that we named after you has all grown up, and she is, uh, she is quite the powerhouse. She is taken to uh, killing eels with great gusto, to put it mildly. <laughs> so, yeah, I wish you could. I uh, wish it weren't nighttime right now. Otherwise, you could actually see the uh, see how she looks. But she's very cool looking. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you uh, you come out so often. And I figured, you know, marine life. You're a marine biologist student. Mm, made sense. Eck, we'll name one after you here, uh, when I can find the right one. Or if you have a request, I, I could probably accommodate. Okay, we got 50 seconds on this egg. And then, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm a very, I, I'm a sucker for, like, event-colored dinos. I really am. And so I will go out of my way to grab any... Any high-level, good-looking, colored event dino. So. 
Oh, speaking of, hon, there are uh, Ember Wyverns that were on the transmitter. Really? Yeah, remember? Uh, when we got off stream last time? It's true. So. Alrighty. Four eleven. Really? Blue to me though. I know, but I'm like, I'm very torn. What level are the parents? They uh, oh, that's a good question actually. Two sixty tames, I think, to about three ninety. Yeah, I think you're about right. So. That might actually be good relative to the parents. Forget how games look like they're squished yeah. right about the middle. Yeah, when Flamingo they're... Two is at was at three eighty nine. Pickles is at four fifty eight, but that's with a lot of points been into her. So, uh, I I mean I guess that's good enough. I don't know. We'll we'll keep it. So, we have raised or we have hatched our first gig. A dark day has begun for the server. I will go gig crazy before too long. <laughs> nah, that's not darkness. Alright. Uh, well, your gig egg is incubating. Uh, sure. I need to figure out what we're doing today. Otters? That's true. I did say otters, and so we will probably go for otters. It's nighttime, though, so that's going to be... kind of sucks to try and tame otters at night. Although, what I could do, actually, that wouldn't be too bad. I could go for the unicorn. It is on the map right now. But, I did say otters, so let me look at a couple of other things. I don't think, yeah, no, the 260 is still there. Uh... And there shouldn't be any tech rexes that are worth going after. Nope. Alright, otters it is. Uh, aberrant or regular? You don't have a high level male regular. That's true. Okay, regular it is. Uh, I've got coordinates. At least they should still be about the same from the last time we were on. Yep, okay. Sweet! Uh, let's... You gonna come with? Um, I'm just, I'm doing the Jerboa breeding right now, so okay. I'm a little tied to this area. All right, uh, let's go. Oh, there is one thing, you, other thing you missed, Sadie. I got this guy on uh, on Monday's stream because I came across her, and she is just she's pretty. We named her Fruit Smoothie because it felt appropriate. So. But yeah, hope you guys are uh, hope you guys are doing good. Hope it, you're having a good Wednesday, or I guess maybe Thursday for you, Sadie. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna have some fun tonight. All right, so let's see, where do we go? Uh, fifty-four, seven, nine, fifty-two, one, four. Though Monday, we were kind of, or at least I was kind of let down because. Um, I got screwed with the uh, trying to tame you, Tyrannus. There were two 290s in the same area, and as I was trying to build the trap for them, their Carnos turned on them and, and just ate them, and I was very sad. So. Oh, it's been snowing there? Interesting. We got snow here yesterday, but it wasn't thick. Like, it was all uh, melted by the afternoon. Okay, what's where is that gonna put me about ish? That lake? Uh, okay. This is gonna kind of suck to try and find these these otters at night. They have a good idea of their colors until they hatch or until the daytime again. Yeah, I know there there is that too. But it's more like I just I 
these otters are going to be difficult to see because they're just typically so small at night. Uh, I mean, I'm debating if that's even, if it's really even going to be feasible. And if my time might be better spent going off and killing utes to force a high level one to spawn. But whatevs. You freak me out every time you do that without warning. <laughs> Is it... It's good for you? <laughs> I don't know that it is. Ah, okay. So is this the area? Okay, so this is the area-ish, roughly, theoretically, where I'm supposed to be finding these otters. Um, when you're done with the Draboa taming, uh, are you going to go for those Ember Wyverns? I don't know, maybe. There's a 280 and a 270, and I have a feeling you'd be remiss if you let either one of them slip past you. Probably not the 270, because I think what I'm doing is better than that right now, but maybe the 280. Okay. I'm just mentioning it because I know you have a love, uh, fierce love for all things Wyvern on this map. Ooh, Red Beacon. Let's go get disappointed! <sighs> I'm still miffed at Aaron. Sure. Grinding up a Tuso saddle? I don't care at what point in the game you're at. You always keep a Tuso saddle. You don't grind it up. That's just... Ugh. Now we're stuck with the primitive ones. Find another one. Theoretically, but we'll see. All right. Not that I'm expecting anything good from this, but what are we going to get at this red beacon? Uh, Paris or Therry? You got to be kidding me. Oh, okay, good. Oh, you're hitting kind of hard. You must actually be a decent level. Okay, and that is how you survive a long fall on a dinosaur without them taking damage. Did you do the dismount and then remount like where you hit the ground thing? Yeah, I had to because I started slipping down the uh, the mountain on uh, fruit smoothie. Okay, that that could be worse. I mean, it's not fantastic. It's not what I want, but that's it. Definitely could be worse. Got a blueprint for a five seventy damage uh, long neck rifle. Yeah. I'm not going to complain about it. All right. 54, 79, 52, 14. And supposedly there is a 300 otter out there, which I have no idea if it's Easter colored or not, because we did a dino wipe, and I don't know where everything's at now, level-wise. Are you still at my base, babe? No, but I'll be heading back there in a minute. Do you need me to do something? Uh, I mean, I don't think anything will have changed, but tech, check the uh, transmitter, see if there's any gig that has spawned. Figure it's uh, worth a look. And a 460 tech gig. If that were true, I would have many questions. Not the least of which being, when did tech gigs become a thing? Yesterday. That would be surprising since there wasn't an update. Oh, hello, Quetz. Are you worth my time? Probably not, is my guess. I can't even see. Freaking bulldogs right in the way. Dog just wants to be loved. Oh, and I don't mind loving my bulldog. It just happens to be right in the way. Oh, boy. Is this where... 
Oh boy. Okay. Uh, this is... If I remember correctly... Oh, look! Otter! <gasps> it's a female otter! That's 300. Okay, well, I found the 300. Yay. That was quick. Now you just have to keep being able to find it every time you get another fish. Yep, that is going to be the trick. Okay, this is the lake where I'm pretty sure, or at least this is close to where I tamed Chumba. And so I'm a little, little concerned. There's also, the fish here are saber-toothed salmon, so we all know how that can go. But let's see if we can find, find her. Alright, come here, come here. Gosh dang it. Hold still. Why would it do that? These things are actually like a million times easier to tame in the water. But now the thing is, I'm going to lose her because I have no idea where she got off to. <laughs> and let, Okay, no, that's her right there. At least I thought I saw her. Come on. Where are you, Otter? Ah. Okay, I think you're the right Otter. No, you're a fish. Where'd the Otter go? You're a fish, too. So where the crap did this otter go? Alright, later, Eck. Have a good night, man. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah. Where did... Frick! I got a dead fish for it and everything! Oh, wait, is that it? Okay, I think I found it. Okay, yep. I mean, it's unfortunate that you're not a male, because I only have a high-level female so far. Oh, come on. But I will take another high-level female. There we go. Okay, now... Fish, 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 fish? I thought I saw a fish go by me. There's a fish. It's really bright and pinky outside your base. It's what? Really bright and blinky. Well, yeah, I've got, you know, three tech transmitters going right there. Yeah, it's like a rave. That's, that's going to put off a lot of light. Okay, come on. Did he eat the fish or did I drop the fish? I couldn't tell. Tamed at all? I, I I didn't see. Oh! Hello! Oh. I found an artifact! Nice! Yeah! Hanging out under the water. Yep. Well, I mean, it's like X said before. It's, it's like the uh, people who made this map just got bored when it came to the artifact uh, stuff. They're just like, eh, well, we've, uh... No, I don't think I did feed it, because there's a saber tooth salmon corpse. Now, where did that otter go? It's like, you know, they don't really have any rhyme or reason to where these artifacts are placed, mostly. There, there we go. go. Now it's Wrinkled done. Them. Wait, what? Okay, no, I'm only shirtless. You've been shirtless the whole time. Well, yeah, because I was overheating on the last episode, as you might recall. Okay, uh, these 290s are off at a different location, so we will head off to different... You're... Why do you have to be... Oh my gosh, this one's like, it's adorable. It's got like a little... Look at that face! Okay, I... I... Ah! I can't believe that I'm doing this.
Where did that fish I just killed go? It's not letting me claim the baby Turboa. It's not what? It's not letting me claim the baby Turboa. Really? Odd. Why would that be? That makes no sense. I don't know, but it says claim allowed in seven hours, 23 minutes, and 59 seconds. Or seven days, 23 hours, 59 minutes. And you have no ability to claim it? It's not giving you any option at all. I'm seeing. Uh, try picking up my Draboa and then putting it back on the ground. Sometimes they get, like, kind of clipped into their parents' hitbox. I mean, I would imagine it's not quite as bad with Draboa because they're so much smaller, but... This baby is well away from your Draboa. It kind of bounced away when it was born. Interesting. I do not know what to tell you then, hon. What I do know is that this otter decided to uh, vanish on me. Which makes me quite sad. I can't believe there was an artifact there that whole time. Now it took me like, you know, several minutes to notice it. I feel like such a noob now. Oh, there we go. Let me get it finally. Okay, good. I am glad. It was sad. I was afraid it was going to starve to death. You taking it back to your base? Yeah. No. It didn't get fed enough? It took me so long to claim it that it starved to death. Sorry. I am sad. Well, if it's any consolation, I can't find this otter that I was looking to tame because it was just absolutely adorable. Which makes me quite sad, too. You will find it. Probably not, but it's not that big a deal. It was only... It, it was level 40, but the thing is it had, like, such incredible Easter coloration. Like, it had, like, this this green and pink snout. Aww. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm looking... It, you know me. With this map, I've, I've been very much not trophy taming. But this one, I'm just like, I, I can't not trophy tame it. Sometimes you just gotta... Otters are kind of irresistible in that way. Otters and Jerboas, at least for me. I mean, Jerboas, I can see where you're coming from. They're not quite as... I'm not quite the same. But I can see where you're coming from. But, alas. Basically, yes. Uh, I may have to call it. I may have to concede defeat on this one. Which would make me quite sad, because it was a very pretty otter, but alas, I don't think I will find her. Oh, well, I got the, the 300. That's I, I'm content with that, at least. So... I left my male Jerboa over at your place, and I'll try again on Saturday. Okay. How long did it take to uh, to uh, have the baby born? 15 minutes. And what's the cooldown? Um, I guess it's somewhere between 6 to 8 hours. I'm not sure. It's longer than one stream, essentially. The cooldown's a lot shorter uh, than on our usual servers still has many hours of cooldown. Uh, okay, well, whatevs. Uh, Alright, well, we are off to go see if we can find a high-level male otter and hopefully get one that is Easter color. And then we will name him, I'm not sure, Winston, Jeeves, something proper Victorian English. Wooster? Wooster could work. If that's, you know, like I said, proper Victorian English. I don't know, I'm just, I'm thinking, you know, classic, like, butler name. Reginald. Ooh, I like. Reginald it is then. Because unfortunately, I got Oscar 
well, I mean, fortunately, I got Oscar super early on in the series. I think it was actually the first Tame, but that was before we got the levels set right. And so he came out, like, super ridiculously low level compared to where I want him to be. And so we don't have a high-level male otter, which Oscar should always be a high-level male otter, but he's not. And so, yeah, that's where we are. <laughs> Let's see, 36, 75, 62, 61. Alpha Blood Wyvern. Where? Uh, not far from where we killed all those Tussos. Really? What level? Indeed. You gonna take it? Um, I don't know, considering how much that other one walked there in space. Okay. He was pretty sure he was gonna lose his tame, and the reason he didn't is he kited it back to his place, and the tornado of death did. True. I, I don't know. I'm just, I'm pitching it as an idea, is all. If you want to join me, I will tell you where it is. Uh, I very well might. Uh, but I am otter hunting at the moment, so. Not going anywhere? Yeah, that can be for a uh, Saturday stream or something. Okay. 3675, 6261. Uh, I thought everything out here was, like, aberrant. And yet... Wait, what? Okay, I guess not. Interesting. Okay, well, let's give this a try. If I'm not gonna... If I can stop flying into uh, an island for a second there. Ooh, beacon. Okay, we'll go for the beacon first. Because I always like disappointment. So, Sadie, you have a good Easter with your family? Oh, other beacon. You come down yet? You have. All right, come on. Come on, there we go. Uh, yep, disappointment. That's all that I got. Sometimes you just gotta go home. I can totally get that. But glad you had a good Easter. Ours was, uh... Oh, cool. I got a Rex saddle. Yeah, not a blueprint and a uh, saddle, but still. I will take. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta be around family again. I can totally understand that. Actually... That's better. That actually probably would have helped me find the other otter. Yeah, our Easter, though, was kind of, uh, well, thankfully kind of uneventful. Really didn't do a whole lot. So, but my parents are in town. We're doing sushi with them tomorrow, and, uh, yeah, that's, that's really kind of it. Uh, that is a debatable statement. It is... You certainly can go wrong with sushi. <laughs> and if you go wrong with sushi, it goes wrong very, very badly. But if... We've we, gone wrong with this place, though. No, this place has never had a... We've never had a bad meal there. Just 
So we're, we're very much looking forward to it. It's a nice little uh, all-you-can-eat sushi place about a half hour away from where we live. Of course. Well, I'm here. I'm out here looking for a 290 Otter. And there's just three Ichthys flying around. Just wait. Shoot them out of the sky. Just waiting to be their usual jerk selves. Uh, no, it's not a conveyor belt one. It's uh, one. So basically, what you do is they give you a piece of paper when you start getting your meal, or when you sit down, and uh, then you just fill out what rolls you want, and they make them and then bring them to you. And it's like twenty bucks a person. Yeah, no, it's it's super nice. And, and you think, you know, all-you-can-eat sushi, like, you, you think kind of like janky, maybe sushi buffet, but no, this place is really, like, it, like it's not, you know, top dollar, high class establishment, but, you know, basically solid restaurant. It, it's, it's not like a golden corral or just some cheap buffet. Here comes a baby death. Okay, thank you for the heads up. All right, could there be otters in here? Yes, there could be, because I see one right there. Ottering around. Yep. Just ottering around. I could spot it with the freaking... Like, I can keep seeing it, but it, like, every time I pull out the spyglass, I can't... I can't nail it down. Oh, you are a very Easter saber tooth salmon. You slipped past me, you little bugger. Oh, is that some Easter coloration I see? It very well might be. <gasps> it is. Oh, but you're only 200. And female. Uh -huh. She's very Easter colored, though. the same one are you the same one please don't be the same one nope you're a 180 male dang it but also very easter colored ah come on there's got to be a high level male out here with an easter color do i have my scuba stuff on me i do good that's gonna make this a lot quicker So I have it entirely filled up a uh, large storage box with chippies. <laughs> you have been hatching a lot of chippies, that is for sure. And I am profoundly jealous still of the fact that you got not just one wyvern, but two, and one that just looks amazing. Profoundly jealous. All right, there should be two otters in this lake that are around that that are 290. But I've only seen those two otters that I saw at the outset and everything else in here is fish. You're very oh, you're only 30. There's a very Easter mammoth near where I'm at. An Easter mammoth? No, I am quite good. I am quite content otherwise. The moon just got darker. Uh, there, what? It's flying around and the moon got darker. Right. Interesting. Hmm. 
should probably get back closer to fruit smoothie. I don't like the fact that I'm seeing uh, ute, uted carnos around here. I don't like the idea of leaving her completely alone on that side of the beach. He thinks uh, you might scream at her and there she goes. And uh, more like I think the Ute would scream and the Carnos would go, there they go. And I would not have a ride home. That's That's my bigger concern. Are you... You're, you're the 180, aren't you? Yeah, you're the 180. Ah, you're such a beautiful Easter color, too. Uh, well, actually... They're... They are not actually near here, so I'm probably safe. Uh, because I'm, like, right by where Aaron's got his oil rigs. So... Yeah, I, I'm probably good for right now. Like, I see some mammoths fighting something, but... I'm not gonna worry too much about it. Although, I could actually just fly her over here. And then she can land by uh, by the oil r rigs and should be alright. Alright, you stay there. Don't do anything stupid. And of course she does, because she's a wife and silly like that. That's true. They do that quite frequently. Which is unfortunate. But you never know what your team is going through. Man, I've only seen the two otters in this lake. And that makes me sad. That makes me very sad. Because there should be two 290s in this general area. 36... 62, I'm at 33, 60... Oh, hello, Ute. I just saw a Ute eat one of its Carnos. Our circle is now complete. Oh, that is a very... Oh, you're not actually bad. There's a very, 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 very Easter date on here. And I'm tempted. Oh. 260. So lower than I'd like, but... It's like green and blue and gone. Oh, there it is. I thought something just ate it or something. I, I thought something did too. That's why I was like... I was immediately concerned. Uh, you know what? I can probably do it. Oh, great. It's coming after me. But I am in scuba. I can swim faster than you. Don't swim very fast. No, they're not great swimmers. I mean, they're not like, you know, as bad as gigs, for example, but they're not fantastic swimmers. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. I wasn't wearing a shirt. around to see if that 420 ember wire made any eggs. Oh, you're doing a run in the um, wyvern trench? Yeah. Well, have fun with that. Because there are two 420 ember wyverns in this area, which I'm hoping means a 420 ember egg. Which would be a bit of improvement. Oh yeah, by far. By far. Okay, Daydon, where are you going? I'm right here. Come on, buddy. Mm. 
No, that's that's very much the wrong direction. This is the direction I don't want you to be going. Okay, there we go. Yeah, come on, piggy. Come on, crispy bacon. Come on. I team you, I'm naming you Bluebell. Just so you know. Bluebell? Uh, you should take a look at her. Is she that blue? She's got a lot of blue. From crispy bacon to bluebell, and my brain goes, bluebell's a type of ice cream, but pigs don't give milk, so... <laughs> Why are you naming your pig after ice cream? I don't know. It seemed right. Why do I do half the things that I do? The lull. Also true. Well, Piggy's dropped to the bottom of the river. Well, I know. Well, I, I mean, she's not being tamed. She's just... This is how she's apparently deciding to swim now. Is to walk, walk along the bottom of the river. No, come on, Pig! That's how Barbosa's pirates did it. That's true, but she is not one of Barbosa's pirates. She is a pig. Come on, I only have limited stamina. Same with you. And now she's running away from me. Oh, good. For that many? Yeah, I think so. Good. She's running towards where I want her to go. Which, good, 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 good. Go on over here. Yep, that's right. Get onto the island where you will be safe. I promise. From everyone but me. <laughs> there we go. Alright, sweet. Well, we will have our date on. Are you going to find her a uh, mate? Uh, possibly. If I find a high-level date on male while I'm out here, I'll probably tame him, but I'm not going to go out of my way. However, because I want to keep her safe, and because there's a ute with his posse around here patrolling this island, or at least I thought there was, Okay, uh, they seem to be... Nope, there's the Ute. I think his posse's gone, but he's here. Uh, kinda? See, I, I, I'm gonna kill the Ute, because I want the, the raw prime. Okay, so he's got one Carno here. Which will still give me some raw prime. Okay, apparently I got no raw prime off of either of them. It's fantastic. That's helpful. Okay, Piggy, what about you? Are you going to give me any raw prime? No, you're not. What is... Frick, why are you guys all being so stingy? They're being very mean with the raw prime distribution right now. Well, that's been fun. No, it's not. Alright. You want a mammoth? Mammoth. Uh, I'm good for the moment. Alright, let's make sure this thing is not... I mean, it shouldn't be losing oxygen. Oh wow, that might be ready to tame already, frick. Don't think get them really super fast. Yeah, apparently they do. So, I don't have enough raw prime to tame it just off of that, but between raw prime and raw meat, I should be good. 
So. But yeah, no, this this thing's pretty dang hungry. Fruit smoothie, what are you doing? Why are you walking away from me? Get back here! No, stop! Stop, you stupid dragon! I told you she'd do something stupid. Yeah, of course. Because because that's what mounts do these days. They go wide yeah. off and curl up in a corner and, you know, go all emo. Slowly gaining sentience. Crying about, you know, if life is so fair, why do roses have thorns and all that other emo stuff? Roses have thorns, so that way a song can be written about it. Yeah, exactly. Other emo stuff. Let's see. Uh, level 40. Level 200. I came out here for otters, and I see no otters, and it makes me sad. <laughs> it makes me very sad. I can find some more. I've They're all over. I've only seen the two that I saw when I first got here. And so, you know, like, those were the first things I saw, and I was like, oh, cool, the, this place is going to have tons of otters. And no, it's had only those two. I mean, it's like 3662 is where I need to be. Well, aren't you using the coordinates you got two days ago? Yeah, but I mean, the stuff stays in stasis. It doesn't really turn over. Something killed it. Someone would, have, someone would have had to be here for that to happen. Plus, I think these are actually coordinates I just got. I could be wrong, though. Okay, what are you? 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 You're the 200 female. Okay. Very Easter stuff around here. Okay. Uh... Oh, it, am I in the wrong lake? I might be in the wrong lake. That might explain it. Another one close by? No, I'm looking at the map and uh, it's entirely possible that I, I miscalculated which lake I needed to be in. That is a, oh my gosh, that is a super Easter beaver. Oh, I thought you were only super. Ah, uh, well, obnoxiously bright neon green, orange, and teal. Nice. Yeah, but it's only level 30, so. Okay, so I'm at 36. Yeah, I might be in the wrong spot. Well, while I'm here, let's hatch these uh, dodo eggs. Are you back at your base? No, I'm not back at my base. I just I found some dodo eggs on the ground. And I found some compies. Oh, cool. I got a party rex, Chibi. Nice. Yeah, aren't I lucky? Okay. And no dice. No. No good, Chibi. Okay, I think I'm actually at the wrong lake. I, I thought that, you know, I'd land by here and that I could... That it was just, you know, a matter of swimming around here. But I guess not. So, I will head back to a different set of coordinates. Just glad I've got spare scuba on me, although my tank is busted. Uh, did you end up going back to my base? 
I did. Did you look for a gig? Yeah, the highest one was 200, and I think there's like two level 30s or two level 40s or something like that. Yeah, I, I figured as much. That's kind of why... I, I, that's one of the reasons I think it was a good idea to do a Dino Wipe, just because everything was staying fairly stagnant without, you know, a bunch of people on the server to constantly keep things moving around. Everything's just going to stay in stasis. So, is what is. Alright, Piggy should be done by this point. Yep, Piggy is done. Piggy? What? Miss Piggy? Well, it is a female, so yes, it would be Miss Piggy. And it has apparently eaten all the food that I left on it. Do that? Yeah, and it's still hungry. Hungry? Uh, not terribly, but it, noticeable in the little food icon. Okay, let's let's try this again. See if we can find find what we're looking for. So thirty six sixty two. Oh, I might have been way off course. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is a little isolated lake. Oh, now you know. Yep. I think. I think it's an isolated lake. Eh, whatevs. We'll see. Hopefully it's not the waters. Well, let's see. I'm at 36.8, 63.2, and where I needed to be was 36.75, 62.61. So I'm not too far off. I think I'm in the rough, general, same area. So hopefully one of these two 90s out here is a male. And ideally, one of them will be very Easter colored. But we will see. Okay, well, and I'm already seeing otters, okay. Oh, you're, you're very Easter, what art? Okay, you're 170. You're 290. Uh, you're, ooh, you're a very Easter female, though. Do we need to have, like, aberrant otters, regular otters, and Easter otter dynasties? Maybe. There's literally an arrow sticking out of this fish! And it didn't kill it! Okay, are you the 290? Come on, I thought no, you're you the 170. Found what? From you found it with an arrow. I'm like, who shot a fish in a random pond and left it there? Uh, I mean, if anyone would, I could see Aaron doing it. Though more likely Ben. Yeah, more like Ben. That, that sounds more like a Ben thing to do. Now that I'm thinking about it. Okay, where did that... Uh, where'd it go? Other disappearing act. Yeah, they, they are very good at that. As we have found out. Repeatedly. Slip away. They do. Okay, I found... I found her. So now I gotta get enough fish to actually tame them. And I gotta keep finding them, and that's gonna be the trick, because they seem to be very, very, very elusive. But they do have a heart icon above them, so that means a mate boost. So I'm hoping, very much hoping, that there is a male. And that it's the two... Well, I mean, obviously there's a male, but that the male is the 290. Oh, I just found an Easter egg. Oh, wow. Oh, gosh dang it. I didn't want to tame the 90. You found an Easter Jubala? Nice. Okay. 
I, I, I literally shot that arrow into that fish's back. How does Use that happen? Sword. Use your sword. Uh, that's... I mean, I could, but I, I find that that's way too easy to accidentally overswing. And get, and kill the fish, rather than... Yeah. There are... Okay, no, that was just R, an RGB issue. It looked like there were a bunch of, like, crystal gems out here. Interesting. Yeah. I mean, there's not. Because I was just having an RGB thing going on, but... Yeah. I actually killed it. You you killed it? On accident, yeah. How did you accidentally kill it? And why? I, I, was, I just forgot I was holding a torch. You forgot what? Holding a torch. Oh, so you went up to try and... Knock it out or something? Yeah, I tried to punch it and I set it on fire. Okay. <laughs> Wow, that that escalated quickly. Not a night for your bones to feel safe. No, no, it's not. Okay, otter swimming around me. Which one are you? Feed them all. I I really don't have the patience to do that. Okay, you are the one I need. Stop. All right, where'd you go? Gosh dang it. Gosh dang it, where's that stupid otter? I think you're facing one main issue tonight. Otters being elusive? Yeah, I, I'm inclined to agree. Oh, there you are. Okay. At least I'm pretty sure. Wait. Nope. Wrong otter. No, feed it anyways. Claim all the otters. Then you won't miss the 290. <laughs> I will leave this one in Aaron's base and just let him question where the heck it came from. I don't think there's enough fish in here to do that, is the problem. So unless the fish start spawning much faster, uh, that that might be... that, that I don't think that's within the realm of possibility. Where did that otter... Or, okay, there you are. I'm pretty sure. Uh, or... No? No, you're 170. Bless you. Thank you. Where did that 290 go? Okay, there's like two over here. No. Is that you? No, you're 40. Okay, where on earth did that 290 otter go? This isn't funny anymore. No. Curse Xenu. He's doing it to me again. Were the otters betrayed by their uh, pack of coal camps? Uh, I mean, I've never seen a coal can turn on an otter, or anything. But, I guess they're- oh, wait, is this- Did you swim all the way over here? To avoid- yeah, you did. To avoid me feeding you. Stupid, dumb otter. I'm literally here to give you a meal, and you keep swimming away. Now where did you go? 
I literally just saw you and I can't find you. Oh, there you are. Okay. You just stayed back here. That works for me. Okay, I think one more fish and I got her. Okay, and then it's trying to find the other 290 in this lake. At least, the assuming there is one. Actually, Han, are you anywhere near my base? I'm at my base. Okay, uh... Oh, come on. Break. Okay. Um, I might... Gosh, dang it. You have to make this last feeding the most difficult, don't you? What, 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 what? I literally just saw her just vanish. Poof? Yeah. No, she just poofed in front of me. Oh, there she is. Okay. I don't know what is going on. <sighs> this is getting real old very quickly. Got her. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was about 10 million times more difficult than I feel like it needed to be. Okay. Uh, so, according to this, there should be another otter in this area that's 290 as well. And I have not seen one yet, but I will keep looking. Please be 290 in a male. Nope, you're 60 male. So you probably kill it then. And if you're not going to swim, it won't let it swim around and confuse you. Uh, maybe. I don't want to kill otters. They're too cute. I know. I feel guilty if I do it. Uh, what are you? You're a... Oh, you're a Trudon. Hello. No. You ain't happening. Freaking Trudons. So you are not, as I recall... You are... Yeah, 170 female. What are you two... I could slow down enough, or if you could stay still long enough. A uh, 270 female. I don't think you're... No, you're 40 male. Dang it, why is it that uh, all the, uh, the good otters I'm seeing are not male? That's a very good question. I have no answer. Uh, I don't want to call, call it, but I may have to call it because I don't want to spend all day trying to get just one single otter. I believe that you're, what, 170? Is that right? No, not even. You're third. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Are you killing them? I, yes. I'm sorry, dear friend. I love you. Can do this. You are strong. Uh, 
I'm sorry, friends. You're like Bilbo when he's apologizing to Frodo and Rivendell. I mean, maybe not quite like that harsh, but yeah. But I do feel genuinely bad. They are dying so that the Oscar dynasty may live. Oscar dynasty may live. The thing is, like, they die, and I don't see where their bodies go. Is that because the other daughters eat them? No, they just kind of jump up and then go away. Do they fade into nothingness, like Jedi Star Wars? I don't know, something like that. Okay, what level are you? You're at the 170? Is that right? Yes, you are. Oh, and you're so pretty, too. Thermos, then. Uh, I, I, well, their skin goes away. I can't find it. You get the Thermos before it's dead? It, it like... No, I, I've tried that before. Like, I don't know what's happening, but their, their body just poofs. Sword is too strong. Maybe. Thing is, I'm not getting, uh... I'm not getting stuff in my inventory. I got one body, and then that was it. I'm sorry, otters. Like, I do feel genuinely bad about what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, I'm a terrible human being. All will be well. But will it really? Yes. Will I truly be able to live with the consequences of what I've done? Yeah, probably. But still, I feel terrible. This image of you old and getting ready to peacefully pass, and you're like, if only I hadn't killed those otters on Crystal Isles. Okay, uh, I... It's not what I'd hoped for, but it is a 270 male. Yeah. I was hoping for a 290, but I, at this point, I have been swimming around here looking for a high-level male otter for too long, and I'm kind of done with that. What? That's the plan. It will hold still enough, still long enough to let me. Okay. Uh. Okay. Other coal can't. And where did it go? Where'd you 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 go? Wiggling around. Well, he probably is, but I have no idea where he got off to, and I don't want him wiggling around in an area I can't get to. Oh, there he be. Thankfully, he's sticking around the area where that 290 female was. There we go. Okay. I think two more fish and I should have them. And then we get back to, uh, I don't know, something else. Um. Yeah, we'll start probably, well, times that I don't think we have time to breed them tonight, or at least start. Because it's like 45 minutes. So. Long. I don't know. There's literally an arrow sticking it right out of you.
Okay, one more fish. But alrighty. Oh. I see, he gets sushi. Yeah, he's pretty good sushi. Yeah. I don't... It can't get any fresher than this. You know what would be, like, an awesome investment for, like, a, a deep-sea fishing charter? Hmm. A sushi... A sushi bar. Or, like, a, a sushi chef, too. A lot of them, especially if you're doing, like, tuna and whatnot, will have somebody who knows how to cut and prepare it right there. Oh, yeah. Like, uh, when, when we went, um, deep-sea fishing that one time, like, it was just, like, a, you know, half-day trip, uh, in the San Francisco Bay when I was growing up. Um, they had someone that could gut the fish, scale it, and everything right there. And I remember as we were going back to shore, you know, he was just chucking fish guts off the back of the boat, and we had all these birds following us. So, when I went to New Student Orientation for the business college, I met somebody from Hawaii, and he was telling me about a tuna fishing trip that he took, and they ate the fish on the boat. Oh, that does sound like fun. We, we do need to go out and go deep sea fishing at some point. Oh, oh you got to be kidding me. There's... Did you just 290? No, I found another 270, and he's absolutely stunningly beautiful. I also found a Trudon. I found one of those. Yeah, well, I found another one. And I killed it, but not before they got me. So I got to get out of here real quick. And another Trudon. Trudons do. And another Trudon. Still what Trudons do. Gosh, I hate them. They're so freaking annoying. <laughs> Rick. At least I passed out in the water and they, uh... Yeah. They, they don't like to swim, apparently. No, okay, there's one one more male otter, and that'll give us a little genetic diversity. Woohoo! Of course, now we gotta find it again. You're 40. Oh, there it is. I hate Trudons. You'd be hard pressed to find anyone who actually likes them. What the? Yeah, I don't think anybody likes them. Can you tame them? You can. Don't you have to sacrifice things too? Yeah. Yeah, that's a dumb one. Yeah, the the cost benefit is just not there. Oh, come back. I, I want to see what level you are, buddy. Okay, you're 70. Alright. Okay, where is the otter I'm looking for? You are... You are him. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I'll, I'll get some warmer clothes on in just a minute. Hold on. Hello, kitty cat. Oh, the cat woke up? He came in here making little... sounds. He would. He would. He's so cute. When he wants to be. Let 
Though he's very pathetically cute a lot of the time. Weirdly enough. Because that's a thing. <sighs> Come on. There we go. Okay. I think two more fish and I'll have them. And then I head back to base because we should have... That, that gives us more than enough to work with. Ooh, you're a big coal camp. Come here. This might actually do it. Nope, you're 40 and not wasting it on you. Where'd the other one go? Great, I've got a giant fish that I want to shove down his gob. And, uh... Nothing. He, he's just he's just disappeared. An otter thing to do. It really is, and it bugs me to no end. Are you him? No, you're a 200 female. I'm just glad that I brought scuba gear with me. I didn't intend to. It was just kind of left in my inventory, but man, is it helpful. No, you're level 40. I do not want you. You are not the otter I'm looking for. Frick! Okay, I swear this is the last episode I'm going to do where all I do is tame otters. First time you've done that. Yeah, and probably the last. For whatever other streams we do of this game. Wait, no, you're... Wait, are... Are, are you a different 270? You're a different 270 male. Rick! Now you're finding all the good otters. Yeah, seriously. Except for the one that I already started taming. Bless you. Okay, I believe you're 40. Yeah, you're 40. So where is the other one that was around here that was a similar color? I know he didn't just disappear. I don't see him up here on the shore. Two seventy female. Like, like, where did it go? I've already started taming it. I don't want to leave it. Oh, 290. Okay, I found the other 290, and it's a female. Yay! Yeah, I'm not taming it, though. she angry at the otters at this point? No, I'm not angry. I want to find... The, well, I, I'm already in the middle of taming one, and I don't need another female. I've got, like, three high-level females at this point. If you're that 40 again, I'm going to be very, very sad. Because I think you are that 40, and I want to know where that 270 got off to. Oh, I know, this is riveting content. Edge of your seat. Oh, and look, there's a huge cola can. I'd have that freaking otter tamed at this point if I could find it. Because I've just got this massive fish. And I can't find it. 
But at least it's, at least it's daytime now, and I can actually see better. Oh. Yeah, significantly. You are going to be that 40 still. Yep, you're still that 40. So where did that 270 get off to? I mean, you're the... No. Gosh dang it. Should I just call it? I just want to know where he got off to. Because, like, I fed him, I turned around and found that big fish, and then all of a sudden, I, t you know, I a few seconds later, turn around to try and feed him again, and he's gone. Otters are irritating like that sometimes. Uh, that's putting it mildly. Oh, you're, th you're that same 40. Unless he went all the way over here, which, I mean, in theory, it's possible. No. Yeah. No, because no, you don't have a progress bar, although you are 260. Maybe he's reset? I don't know. I, I still would have something, I think. They don't reset that quickly. At least they shouldn't be resetting that quickly. I don't know. I may just have to call it. Oh, that upsets me. That really upsets me. Did you get stuck in a crack or something? Like, like, what? What happened to my little otter? Just wanted to put a little diversity into the gene pool. Yeah, and he was beautiful. He was pretty. Well, I guess, uh... Is what it is. I thought I saw something slither up this way. Okay, well... All right, well, we will head back to base at this point. We at least got one high-level otter, which I can be happy about. It just bums me out that the one we were already in the middle of taming that had, like, one more fish to go just up and disappeared on us. It was really cool looking, too. It was, like, all maroon and stuff. But, whatever. Whatever. I don't have much time left for tonight, and I don't want to spend all of it chasing down otters, so. So, off we go. We're heading home. You're making very sad sounds out there somewhere. Yeah, I hear him. But, whatever. He's just going to have to deal with it. He's just going to have to deal with it. Besides, we're almost done with the stream anyway. We'll be fine. Well, still, all things considered, you know, it wasn't bad. We did uh, accomplish what we set out to do, which was to hopefully find a uh, high-level male Easter-colored otter. 
and we did. Yep. Along with uh, at least one high-level female. I thought we got two. Yep, we got two, two high-level females. Yeah, two high-level females. We got a uh, a pig. So all in all, not bad. Not bad at all. Surprise. Pig was a surprise, but it's really it's really cool colored. So. And you know what? Screw it. You're too close. Ooh. Ooh, 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 what level are you, beautiful? Oh, okay, let me see if I can grab this. No. There's a very Easter dire wolf. Level. 270. And apparently, yes, you can grab dire wolves with a wyvern. Yeah, I've done that several times. Oh, I didn't know that. Uh, that first one's back. Oh, oh, oh! Wow, that. Ooh. And it's two eighty. Also, oh. oh, I might need it tomorrow or Monday, Saturday. It's an arg. I might not get another chance at it. Yeah, you know what? Whatever. Whatever, I've already got good colored arcs. I don't I need to be careful. I need to calm down. Otherwise, I'm going to end up like taming half the map. You say that like that's a bad thing. Ek already complains every time I get on as it is because it's just too crowded in front of my base. A fact about which he's not wrong. Eh, more dinos. Oh, did you see that Aaron tamed a uh, a King Griffin? I did. So, my, my guess is he came over and used the transmitter. Possibly. Oh, oh, beautiful, 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 beautiful. What are you? What are you? Are you... You're 260. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my... Ah, There's so... There's such good colors. What? No. We might just live in permanent Easter event. Or there's more events coming. That's true. This is very true. But yeah. All right, well, I'll, I'll knock this dire wolf out, and uh, you can add it to your uh, your harem if you want. Uh, wolves come in packs, thank you. You know what I mean. But did you see it? Um, yes, that would be very cool. Do you want it? Sure. Okay. I will let you start breeding with it. Okay. Yes, as they would say in Sims, woohoo. That is what you will be doing with it. I built the Otter Temple. <laughs> you would. You should come see the otters that I've, uh, I'm have i bringing home, though. Oh, well. Oh, there is a red beacon not far from my base. Which I should probably go for. But let's I might see here. Drop these. You might what? Dropping shibbies. I mean go for it. You've probably got numerous duplicates at this point.
Come back here. Come back here, dire wolf. Did you miss the box? I missed the box and then you started running after something. Or she. I have no idea what. Oh, a dodo. It only took like two, maybe three shots to knock it out, though. And then they don't take long aim either. It's quick. Nope. I'm not expecting a long tame. But I am only going to use raw meat, because that's really all I've got. <gasps> I'm surprised at you. Well, I've been kind of focused on something else entirely that's not exactly conducive to giving me said raw meat. Or raw prime meat. I know, but usually you know must do the best. Yeah, but again, I've been focused on otter taming, which doesn't exactly... Give me raw prime out the wazoo. Uh, Sadie, if you're still awake, I can actually now show you pickles, or not pickles, but Flamingo 2 in their full glory. But if you just kind of fell asleep with the uh, stream on, I totally understand, because you're... It's it's way late for you over there. But yep. This was, uh, this was Monday's project. We got ourselves a new gig, and it's very Easter, and it's very awesome. So, very is more awesome. <laughs> oh, cool. But yep, that is uh, this is Flamingo too. If I can actually get down, he was our uh, our little Easter gig. I know, right? Very pretty colors. Alright, well, we are home. Let's get these otters inside. And then we'll get our Tussos going. Doing a little breeding. Uh, did you leave a Draboa here? Yeah, like I said, I left oh, that's the right. mail there. That's right. Uh, okay, well, I'm turning uh, mating off of my Draboa. I already turned it off on one of them. Uh, I mean, maybe you did on yours, but I'm just, just to be safe. Okay, uh... Let's pop out the otters then. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, this is the 74 who's not getting mated with. That I kind of accidentally tamed. Why do I keep scrolling down? I don't need to scroll down. And I know I don't need to scroll down. I need to keep doing it. Uh, you're actually remarkably plain looking. Not that that's a bad thing, just... Yeah. As are you. I thought you were going to be more Easter colored. Look at them. I, okay, so the first one I tamed came out very, very Easter. Uh, I thought the male I tamed would be somewhat Easter too, but I guess not. And then neither was the high level female that I got. So... Rest in the dark. You're always gonna miss something. Yep, but at least uh, at least one of the females is a really high level tame, or a, or and also very Easter colored. So it works. Uh, I might go off screen taming other otters, but unlikely. What I'm gonna go do right now, though, is try and make up for the mistake that I made earlier with my two sos. And not going to hatch a two so right now. We've got a baby gig. Oh, I'm gonna go get a bunch of meat off screen. Don't worry about that. I'm flying over to Super Easter Arg. That's true. You do have a Super Easter Arg now. I'll own up. Yep. I should hatch the Args that I've got too. You really should. All right. Well, they will get to mating. Oh, wait, hold on. No, they won't, because they're, uh, these are two males. So, 
work. Not really. Not for the purposes of what I'm trying to do. Okay, there we go. Oh, but while I'm out here, this is your Moza, Sadie. So, this is what she looks like. Not Easter colored, because neither one of her parents were, but still, quite the chomper. these otters i know right uh sadie we're honored that you spend so much time here and that you uh you genuinely seem to miss the stream when you uh when you're out of town so we're we're the ones that are honored by you and everyone else that that supports us here but yeah see this one's super easter colored i think it should be named colonel mustard oh i could do that but yeah i'm, I'm just kind of bummed that these two didn't turn out the way that I'd hoped they would. I thought that they were going to be more Easter colored than that, but... And her daughter. It is what it is. I'm not going to complain, and we got one with great colors as it is, so we got a lot of gene pool variation to throw around. And our male gets to live out, uh... Live out a guy's dream, I guess. Oh, wow. <laughs> I like her. That's a very appropriate name exact shade you find on those uh, highlighter packs that come in yellow and pink and orange and green. Yep. Uh, well, probably the last thing I'm going to do on the stream for right now. I've got a truck ton of these. Like, I literally just picked up 48, 58. There's, Dang. I can't even pick up all of them that are down. So let's, uh, let's be disappointed again. Some of these eggs. Some of these what? Granis eggs. Yeah, go ahead. That was one of them. Yeah, let me know what you get. I will. So I will probably take it back to my place so that way you don't wake up here again on Saturday and it's full of utes again. I mean, there were only two utes this time, but I, I your point is taken. That. All right, I've just got a ridiculous amount. I've placed 70 eggs in this area. Chibi Rex. Like in, like, an MMO when you find the spider area. Yeah. Chibi Dire Bear, Chibi Scorpion, Chibi Gig. Chibi Tropioganthus. Chibi Anki. Oh, Teeny Tiny Titano. Cool. Chibi Gas Bag, Persotherium, Trudon, Manta, Spino, another Manta, Kentro, Scorpion, Iguanodon. I mean, the Titanosaur I'm, I'm happy about, but I really had hoped for a Wyvern. This will replace the Bulldog? Possibly. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking about it. There's a part of me, though, that still is like, be loyal to your Spinos. And so I'm like, uh, maybe I need to show love to my roots. But alright, I'll hatch these last 30 and then we'll probably call it, because it's getting a little late and I have just a few other things to do uh, off stream. So. Uh, we'll get meat. Mostly, so. See, so I got an Overraptor, a Stego, another Rex, and that's it. Ah, <sighs> well, not exactly the most action-packed stream, but uh, not terrible either. So, <laughs> we'll be back Friday with uh, with Lotro lore for dummies and uh, new stuff to, that will be happening there. But until then, I'm Vanlin. And this is Cow Elf Gaming. We'll catch you in the next one.